Austin, Nathan Avaldi took a no-hitter into the seventh inning. What was he doing well that allowed him to get through so many innings so economically? I mean, you said it. He did everything well. Um, we went out and we started to attack people. It's a pretty free-swinging club over there, so we wanted to attack him. Uh, he made pitches when he needed to make pitches. All three commanded him. That was the best I've seen this year. We got something to build off. That was real good. Clearly, that uh, splitter was his swing and miss pitch. How good was that pitch in particular tonight? Yeah, it, it, was, it, it was real good. Uh, a lot of swing and misses. We could go to it whenever we wanted. We threw it in some 2-1 counts. I mean, it, it really kept him off balance all night. Um, that was a good performance for him. He had talked a lot about using that slider more in spring training. That pitch in particular, does that help set up that splitter? How much do you think that has helped his repertoire, that slider overall? Yeah, when you command three pitches, I mean, when they have to honor all three, it's going to help you out in the long run. I mean, again, we could use all three pitches at any time in the count. And, you know, we went after some people, and it's a good thing to build off. For you offensively, two hits. How do you manage to stay ready when you know you're not in there every day offensively? You know, my job, my first job is to catch. Um, I'm trying to get Team W, trying to limit as many runs as I possibly can. The hitting is just a bonus at the end, but just working with AC and Marcus and, and keeping my rhythm at the plate and getting some good balls to hit. Well, you did a nice job on both ends tonight. Austin, thanks for the time. Thank you. Send it back to you in the studio.